What's going on everyone, Drew here. Today I'm gonna to tell you about the cheapest iPad photo booth software. You guys have probably already know what I'm gonna say, it's called LumaBooth. There, obviously there's software that's free, there is some software that is cheaper than LumaBooth, but if we're talking about a overall complete, you know, has all the technology, bells and whistles that you will want in a photo booth app, LumaBooth is the cheapest and it's by far my favorite app. Look guys, I have resources and, and access to pretty much every software, right? Uh, I've, I've used most of them on the market and to me, LumaBooth is a no brainer. So this is a perfect software for anyone that wants just a DIY photo booth, right? Let's just say your wedding's coming up. You don't wanna break the bank, you wanna cut corners, maybe build your own photo booth. This software will have everything that you need. And luckily for you guys on my channel, I have tons of content on how to use LumaBooth, how to set it up and make templates and all that. And then on the other side, right? Let's just say you're not a DIYer. It's also perfect software for professionals, right? If you're like me, you know, you wanna run a business, make a living in the photo booth business, and you're running iPad photo booths, LumaBooth, LumaBooth is it. Okay, so let's real quick talk about how to get LumaBooth. Um, let me just get this out of the way. If you wanna get LumaBooth and you're new to LumaBooth, at a discount, and also have access to our private group chat for the software. Click the link below, sign up. You can either pay for the month or annually. Um, when you do that, you know, sign up, pay, then send me an email at hustlewithdrew at gmail.com. Let me know what email address you use to sign up. Then I will send you the link to the group chat. So we got that out, out of the way, right? Um, with the code, it is like $17 a month if you're using our promo code, and I believe right now it's 195 for the year, you can use up to two different devices on that subscription. So let's just say you wanna use it you know, a couple times for one month, just do the monthly. But if this is something that you wanna do, you, know, you wanna go full force and you really wanna grow business, just pay for it annually. So anyways, let me just open this up. So I have the uh, iPad recording here. I'm gonna open up LumaBooth just to show you guys a little behind the scenes of what this app can do. So you see right here, this is the welcome screen. This is all customizable in LumaBooth. Um, I'm gonna hit the drop down menu. You can literally see here everything that you can change and play with in the app, right? Um, so welcome screen. This is exactly what I was talking about. A welcome screen is literally, you guys, let me lower the brightness here so you guys can see it. It's literally, let me launch the event. It's what people see when they walk up to the photo booth. I don't know if you guys can see that. I can adjust the brightness a little bit more. So, so it's like, it's, it's literally what it means. Welcome screen, they walk up to it, this is what they see. Um, you can customize this in LumaBooth. So let's just say you go to the welcome screen option here. You can choose the background, you can turn it on. You can literally write the text here, font, upload your own image. So let's just say you wanna get a little bit more precise with the, with the design. You can go to Canva, Photoshop. You can literally upload it to here. Um, also, print layout, also known what we call in the industry a template. You can make it in LumaBooth or you can import it. Let's just say, again, Canva or photo, Photoshop, you can do that. And what I love about LumaBooth is you literally can, can run your whole event and create it on your iPad. So right here, you can move photo number three. You can adjust it just how you see. Um, they have presets here, so you don't have to do the classic two by six strip. You can also choose to do a, let's just say a four by six layout, right? All of this stuff is customizable, everyone, you guys. So this is what I love the software, super easy to use. You literally, you know, take an hour, play with it. You can learn the soft software really well. Um, presets, just like you've seen. So that's what you could do with the software. Uh, now to capture mode. This is where this app stands out, right? When I mentioned earlier in the video, like, yeah, there's other softwares that you can use that are free. Other softwares that may be a little bit cheaper than LumaBooth. But LumaBooth has GIF option, Boomerang, and video. So it's not just an, a photo booth now, right? Your traditional photo booth app will just take a photo, put it on a layout, maybe you could put a little design, but now you can literally add GIF. That's literally just three photos or two photos taken and it plays it in a video loop. Then it has the Boomerang option, where you literally can take a boomerang, it's a burst of photos, and then it puts it in a video loop. You can have that loop play back slow or fast, which is really, really cool. And then video, it's just what it is, a video clip. And then, again, another reason why LumaBooth is so great for the price, you can now, for all of those capture um, modes, right, like boomerang, GIF, video, and the photo option, you can fine tune it. Like literally, the, t the seconds in between photos, the delay, you can, change, you know, 
the GIF option to have it do two photos, three photos, four photos, and then so on and so forth for all of this. And again, another plus of Luma Booth is, let's just say you don't even have a photo booth. You wanna do a 360 booth. Luma Booth can do 360. That would be done under the boomerang option. You would just deselect all the other options. So just going through here, you guys, just to give you a glimpse of what the software could do. You can also print, which is amazing. You know, you can definitely text, email photos instantly. It's called a digital photo booth, but it will also allow you to do printing, which is very, very easy with this software. So just to see here that you can do that. There's multiple ways to print, air print. Uh, you could do Luma Booth Assistant. That's where you get a laptop connected to your printer. Now you have a wireless printing setup, or you can use like a DNP dongle or, you know, one of those other dongles there, which is also wireless. Um, background removal. All right, this is one of my favorite options to do with Luma Booth. Uh, what is it, right? It's literally called background removal, also known as AI removal, where you don't need a backdrop. So you see, you know, all my videos, I have these backdrops. That's what your traditional photo booth would look like. You have the photo booth with the backdrop or you're in a tent. Now on the software, right? Let me turn this off. <laughs> you can pick a digital backdrop, point your photo booth at a wall, it'll take a photo and it'll crop the person out and put whatever design you want on there. This is again why I say this software is the most affordable software for those that don't wanna pay a lot of money for a photo booth. Um, let's just say you wanna get a ring light, throw an iPad on there, and you don't wanna invest in any backdrops, you want something simple, you could still have a great time and have that cool customization with uh, this function here. And I do have a video on my channel uh, walking you guys through the AI uh, background removal setup. So now is effects, also known as filters. Luma Booth has tons of filters to choose from, which is amazing. A lot of people like to do this and change it up. Um, you know, you can also customize this. You can add your own filters. Uh, I've never seen anyone do that, um, but they have something here. If you see right here, it's called Glam, right? Let me uh, deselect these so you guys can see. This glam feature. This right here is a really, really neat feature made really popular by Kim Kardashian. Um, if you ever go to her Instagram and you see those black and white photos, it's using a similar filter like this. So you would select black and white glam. Then right here, he says beauty mode, you turn it on. And then you see where it says skin and remove blemishes. There's like a, a number scale that the higher you go, the more softer people's skin will look. Uh, but if you're using this option, right, the black, and, uh, the the glam filter with the beauty uh, blemish on, you have to use a white backdrop. The photos look amazing, but only with a white backdrop. So another feature, you guys, there's so many things that this app can do, the software. Stickers, also known as digital props, meaning, you know, you could take a photo and then after the photo's taken, you see all these, uh, where it says stickers, you could literally, you know, touch one, drag it and move it onto the photo. So it's called a sticker because imagine you're getting a sticker and then you slap it on there. So. I, I like to call them digital props. And again, if you're on a budget, you don't need props now. Now you can literally either upload your own, Luma Booth has also a selection of digital props that you can use, or you can buy the ones that we have. We have a lot of digital props that you can buy on our uh, website, photobooth101.com. I'll leave a link to the digital prop pack down below. You go to our website, you purchase it, then you can import it into Luma Booth. So this is really, really cool. I love that it has this. Um, all right, so the, the, that's pretty much like the functionality, right, of setting up your photo booth, fine tuning, you know, like the photo settings, the template, the welcome screen. Now, if you see up top on, now we're at the half, the right side of it, sharing and add-ons. This is the cool, this is where it gets a little geeky here and a little nerdy. So email, SMS, basically you can turn on to, to allow guests to send an email. So you see where it says on. If they take a photo, that email will be an option. So meaning they could take a photo, type in their email, you can turn that off, you can turn that on. You could literally change what's in the subject line so when they get the email, it could be like, hey, thanks for using our photo booth at our wedding. Or you could put like, hey, thanks for using our photo booth from our photo booth rental company. You can even plug your own business here, be like, if you wanna quote, send us an email or give us a phone call. So you can customize all of that. And then SMS, also known as text message. Again, you could turn it off, you can turn it on. Then when they get, when they use the SMS, they put their phone number in, they get a, a, a message with a link to download the photo, and then you could type in whatever message like, hey, here's your photo from Rustic Charm Booth, or you know, you can change the country code if you're doing it in a different country. Like let's say you're in America and you wanna to go to Mexico, you'd have to change the country code. Um, 
And then Instagram, you can have it upload to Instagram. We leave that off. Uh, what's next? Sharing settings. Again, we're talking about what options they have when the booth is being used to share. So cloud sharing, you can turn that off. We leave it on. Um, you see where it says upload original photos. You don't have to do that, but one thing I love about it is the QR code. Meaning, after a photo is taken, you know, obviously you have to be connected to internet to do this. Give it about five to 10 seconds, depending on how strong your internet signal is. A QR code pops up, uh, an option to press it. Uh, so you press the button, a QR code pops up. Just like you do at a restaurant, you get your phone, you turn the camera, you can download your photo from a QR code. So that's really, really neat. I absolutely love that. Um, WhatsApp option, we don't do that. Virtual attendant, that's the next thing I wanted to show you guys. So you can turn it off, but when you turn it off, basically what happens is it just runs a regular session. You don't hear any voices, no one guiding you. But when it's on, you can literally, let me just demonstrate it here, right? You can literally have a voice guiding the person using the photo booth and it's played via the uh, iPad speaker. So just to give you an example where it says before capture, it says get ready. Just to give you a, an example. Get ready. You know? Great job. And then the last photo, just to prep them. Last one. So this is really cool. I absolutely love this. You can even import your own voice. So let's just say you're the DIYer that's getting married and um, you could literally have your partner and you giving the commands for the people using the photo booth. like. Hey, take a silly photo for us. And then the last photo is like, um, last photo, I hope you're enjoying the wedding. Like there's, the, the possibilities is endless. And again, back to the price. You know, using our promo code, it's, I believe it's a little bit less than $17 a month. It's around there. You can't beat it. And let's just say you wanted to use it for your wedding. You just, you pay for the month. You can cancel the subscription right? That way you don't get paid, charged again. And then, you know, when you want to use it again, you just start it up. So, you know, I absolutely love this. Um, and this is just so easy to use. It's super, super easy to use. So this is the virtual attendant, uh, survey. So, you know, right below survey, it says exactly what it does. Would you like to ask your guest to answer a survey? Um, we don't really use this, but let's just say you're, you know, you, you own a business, a smoothie shop, barber shop, any business where you could use good feedback, right? Uh, or even a restaurant, you know, you could literally turn it on, put the question, you know, let's just say you own a restaurant. Um, how did you hear about us? Boom, they'll give you an answer. This is important because as a business owner, right? <laughs> Sorry if I'm losing you, but as a business owner, if you know, you're getting this information and they're, you're finding out that people are finding out about you because of Google. Well, guess what? Now you can double down, triple down on Google because that's what's bringing people in. This data is very, very, very important. Um, but for what we do as a rental business, we don't use this option, but it's there, which I think is really, really cool. Now, disclaimer, this is great. So I just turned it on. Um, disclaimer is, would you like to require all of your guests to an ex accept a disclaimer? This can be anything, right? But what most people use this option for is, um, it basically will be like giving, giving permission to the photo booth company to use this content, the photos taken as marketing purposes. Or you could say like, hey, by using our photo booth, you allow us to use it for marketing pur purposes and then also reach out to you via email or uh, SMS, um, depending on how you get your photo, right? So this is really, really useful. Like legally, you should be using this if you're you know, taking the phone numbers and email addresses, which Luma Booth does, it collects that data. You can go back and see what person used the photo booth. You can use that information like an email campaign or a text campaign to get people to book your photo booth. So you can get creative. You can use this for a lot of stuff. Um, and the disclaimer basically forces them to accept to be able to share the photo. So this is really cool. And that's it. That's pretty much Luma Booth in a nutshell. I know this was a long video. I hope uh, you guys enjoyed it. And again, if you do want to use Luma Booth and you're a new user, you want to sign up to get a discount and then also get access to our private uh, Luma Booth group chat, which is on WhatsApp, go in the description, create an account. Then uh, what you do next is you pay for either the month or for the year. And then once you do that, send me an email at hustlewithdrew at gmail.com with uh, just let me know that you signed up using what email, then I'll send you an email or a reply with the group chat link. So thank you guys so much. And again, if you want to start in this photo booth business, right, go to photobooth101.com. We sell iPad photo booths just like this, backdrops, props, 
printers, and we have so much more support that we give you guys when you order from us. So I hope this video was valuable. See you soon. Take care.